Okay, for 3b, ask us to convert a decimal degree into the degrees, minutes, seconds. So it's just the opposite of what we did uh, for a. So on the test, you want to make sure you know how to do both of these types of problems, converting one way and converting the other way. Okay, so here's what we want to do. We're going to first separate this into the decimal. So we have decimal degrees like that. We're first going to convert that over into minutes. So we want to use the conversion factor on it. The conversion factor that we're going to use here is, this is over 1, we want the degree this time to be on the bottom. So I'm going to put 1 degree down below there and the conversion is 1 degree is the same thing as 60 minutes but we're putting the minutes on top this time because we want the degrees to cancel out. So that's our first step. Uh, those 40 we're just going to leave it the way it is and then we're going to multiply this together. That's going to give you 40 degrees plus and when we multiply this together it's going to give us 14.4 minutes. Next thing we want to do is split up the decimal again. We want to keep going until we get whole numbers for all these. Your, de your degrees, minutes, seconds should all be whole numbers. So we do that by doing this. We do 14 degrees plus 0.4, uh, and this is actually minutes here for this one. So 40 degrees, we have 14 minutes, and we have 0.4 minutes here. Now this last one, this minutes, that has to go into seconds so we can get the last part of, of this one. For this, we're not going to use anything with degrees because it's already in terms of minutes. What we're going to do is change the minutes into seconds. Okay, so the way that it works is we have uh, one minute is equal to 60 seconds, so we have one minute is the same thing as 60 seconds. The double hash marks means you have seconds here. So we're going to do 0.4 times the 60. So we're going to get 40 degrees plus 14 minutes plus minutes are going to cancel out there and that's going to give uh, 24 seconds uh, just like that. So if we want to write it in degrees minutes seconds form here's what you would actually put for the answer 40 degrees 14 minutes 24 seconds so you would put this on your answer line you want to put them all together you don't want to leave your answer like this degrees minutes seconds form means that you kind of combine those all together like that